coding one first, which is the error box. And you're gonna need the developer toolbar opened, or you just need it, which is this one. You're gonna have Visual Base. You're gonna have Visual Basics and Add-ins. I'll show you how to get that if you do that. So you're gonna go Ribbon Preferences, and then if Developer is not checked, please check it. Okay. Okay. Now what you're gonna do is to set it up. You're gonna have to go to Add-ins. your macro with error you can give it a description and start creating it now you're gonna have to start coding yeah here so you're just gonna type in message box like that then you're gonna go quotation mark then Whatever you want. That's it. That easy. Then you're going to close. It goes all funny. Then you should go macros, error, run. That you have the macro, you need to go and get a shape. Oh, hang on, I'm just moving the okay. A shape, not any shape can do, or you can choose an action button. I'm just going to choose an action button. There, now you select run macro. Select your macro, or I only have one, which is error, and you click OK. Then you go on to slideshow, you click it. So, whatever I typed in between the quotation marks was whatever you want came up. Just say you type. Just say. So I typed in whatever you want. So just say I want to type in Hello YouTube and stop it. Then then I can edit this action button. Action settings it's called. And cl click error. And then hello YouTube that easy okay I'm gonna show you how to make a picture slideshow widget well you don't actually get the widget you actually make it so first you need to select a few photos I'm just gonna do an example with two add there now I've got our logo so Put that there. Now you're going to give it an X effect. I just basically like, I don't really like an effect. I just get my um, disappear one, so it just disappears like that. Now you're going to want it to be on click when they want the picture to go so when that picture goes we're gonna get we're gonna get another picture and this picture is our little icon for our website called a favicon okay now you're gonna give us an entry effect I just use the blank appear one like that then you might also want to give it an exit effect. Well, 
yeah, like disappear. It will just go. So what you'll do then is you're going to reorder. You've got all your pictures here. That's your first picture going. That's your other picture coming in. The same picture going away. Okay. This one is going to be on click. Make sure that's on click. That's all right. Then you're going to go to picture eight. Now you don't want it on click. You want it after previous. No delay. That's all right. Then this one goes on click. So then it should look a bit like this using your arrow keys or click. So you click to get that picture gone and then you get our lo website logo, Favicon, whatever you want to call it. Then you click for it to go away. You can also use your arrow keys to make it come back. That one come back. Thanks. Bye. first thing might be subscribe please subscribe humans then we're gonna get something else hmm. let's say I hate Subscribing. So that's our first bit. Now, now um, we're going to start animating. So that's going to stay there. Then we're going to have get this one to come. We're going to animate it. So you're going to get it to maybe fade this time. It's a good. Oh, happened. Okay. Oh, <laughs> pressing the wrong thing. Okay, fade. Wherever is fade. Fade. That will come in. Fading. Now you want this one to disappear. Well, I'm not gonna get it to disappear. Just fade again. Yep. Now you're gonna start the animation. This is I hate subscribing. This is please subscribe human. You're gonna get this to come first. Entrance with previous and you're gonna get it a delay. Three seconds is good enough, that's just delay it coming. But if you're going with previous, previous it'll come out straight away. If you delay it, then it'll come out a bit later. You're gonna get this maybe after. One second, maybe. This is a good time. So, now what it will look like is this. Please subscribe here. I hate subscribing. There. That's what it looks like now. Now, we're gonna get a second lot. We're gonna do. Learn to like it. And the other person says, okay. How about that? 
these little yellow things you can move the with with the speaking is coming through the cool. Okay. Okay. There. So now we're gonna animate our second one. This is gonna come out the same. This is gonna, this is gonna come out with the same. We're gonna have to reorder stuff because I did not do it for you. Okay, that's gonna come in. Learn to like it. Straight after. What about delay one second? That. I'm just gonna get you to it. Wow. What's the huge right now? Subscribing is gonna go. After one second. I hate subscribing is gonna go. Okay. It's gonna come in. After one. This might not be right, I'm just thinking. After one. Let's check this out, it might not work. Okay, please subscribe human. I hate subscribing. Learn to like it. Okay. Nope, that is not right. We need a fade for that. Fade out. Then learn to like it. Learn to like it. So, okay. They'll go down. That is gonna after previous. So we're gonna this one. So it's gonna get moved previous. Delay of no second. Let's try that. Please subscribe, human. I hate subscribing. Learn to like it. Okay. What have I done wrong? Let's see. When does OK go away? Ah. It's going to get after previous. Let's try that now. Please subscribe, human. I hate subscribing. Learn to like it. Okay. That's all I'm going to do for you. You can add more panels. You already know. Basically, that's how you do it. You can add more. You can make it. Yeah. It might take a while to get all that after previous, with previous, and on click. You can. Now, on click, you can like click for the things to come up. That's probably better, but I like automatic. Okay, that's all. Bye.